Now, the Fox 61 Weather Watch with meteorologist Ryan Bratton. So, Ryan, today I feel like was the first time I got to use my handy dandy uh, snow broom. And you could find it. <laughs> yeah. Good. Yeah. A lot of people, I feel like they don't even know where they are. I keep <laughs> mine in my trunk, actually, Perfect. just in case. Good. Well, yeah. You're smart to do that. And it's good we had a little bit of snow today mm -hmm. uh, just to kind of prep us for what's coming Monday night into Tuesday morning. Yeah, it's going to be pretty bad, right? It's going to be the first yeah. widespread accumulating snow of the season. Mm -hmm. Take until late February. Pretty crazy. We do have a weather watch alert up for Monday night into Tuesday morning. Your evening commute on Monday should be just fine. But just after the evening commute, it looks like snow will start between about 7 and 10 p.m. The heaviest of the snow falling after midnight into Tuesday morning, and that is when the trickiest travel will be likely impacting the morning commute. There likely will be some delays and cancellations, and then the weather will improve improve as the day Tuesday goes along. Here is a storm that's been impacting California. You've probably heard about it uh, with feet of snow in the mountains, not even far from LA. And this storm will be traveling across the country. It'll reform offshore. And for the first time this winter, we will be on the cold side of the storm. Almost all of the storms this winter have involved some type of a wintry mix, but I don't think we'll have too much of that out of this one. Tonight, though, it is starting to quiet down. A couple of flurries left in the Northwest Hills. Otherwise, it is cold. It's 18 in Waterbury, 17 in Torrington, 24 in New Haven, and 24 degrees in Groton as well. The rest of the night, the temperatures will not drop a whole lot. We'll stay in the upper teens to low 20s. Tomorrow will turn out to be a milder day. We'll get into the low 40s in the afternoon. A lot of clouds around, and there may be a flurry or a little bit of drizzle or a light shower coming through. I don't think it's anything like we saw today, but there may be a couple of drops or flakes out there tomorrow. We'll clear out tomorrow night and then all eyes turn to the storm, which moves in Monday night. During the day Monday, you're just fine. It will be cloudy Monday afternoon. Snow moving in for Monday night with the heaviest falling after dark, continuing into Tuesday morning, and then things should lighten up as the day Tuesday goes along. This is 8 o'clock Monday morning. A little bit of sun out the door, but then it's cloudy by the afternoon. 6 o'clock in the evening, it's snowing down around New York City, and then this snow moves into Connecticut between about 7 and 10 o'clock. Overnight, periods of snow falling moderately, perhaps heavily at times into Tuesday morning. This is 8 o'clock in the morning on Tuesday, and I think by 8 or 9 o'clock, the bulk of the accumulation will be on the ground, and then during the day, we'll have off and on lighter snow and maybe a little bit of drizzle at the shoreline. For most of the state, looking at 4 to 8 inches of snow, it'll be a plowable, shovelable snow all across the state. Could be a little bit less in southeastern Connecticut. The snow may not stack up quite as much there, but either way, all of us looking at an impact out of this Monday night into Tuesday morning. Here's a look at your next seven days. Tomorrow is mostly cloudy. High temperatures in the low 40s. There may be a flurry or sprinkle around tomorrow. Dry during the day on Monday, increasing clouds through the day, and snow moves in Monday night between 7 and 10 p.m. Snowing hard at times overnight Monday night into Tuesday morning. I do think Tuesday afternoon will be a little bit better, so if you have plans Tuesday afternoon and Tuesday evening, certainly once the roads are plowed and treated, uh, things should be better by that point. We may warm up on Thursday, and then we'll have to watch another storm at the end of the week. We'll have much more on all of this coming up in just a little while. Carmen.